Yo, Beeb, thanks for the, the sawbuck, pal. Can of sardines? Ugh. I love sardines. I ate so many cans of sardines when I was pregnant. I'm going... Look, I'm going to have to figure it out because I'm not into taking fish oil anymore. Sardines are my only option. They're tasty. They taste like tuna. They taste better than tuna, actually. Uh, I'm going to have to get shredded before I eat them. Oysters are the best for zinc, but really, any shellfish is high in, in zints. Shellfish is nasty. Scallops are kind of good, but just those things are disgusting. Leo, I hear you that it's a must, but I just don't trust it anymore. I just don't trust it. I don't know what to say. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. I just don't trust those things anymore. Right. How do you like your tuna? Do you like it with mayo or with what? Tuna fish? Yes. Like the Mayonnaise. Tuna. A little bit of relish. Then just make the sardines the same way. It tastes just... Yeah, delicious. but it sounds disgusting to make... To mince up... What's the difference Ugh. between a tuna and a sardine? They're both fish. No, you're right. Don't be American. Yeah, Leo, they seem legit, but... Dude, if they were legit, they'd be shut down. I'm sorry, man. I don't want to hear it either. I don't want to hear it either. But it's the truth. I don't want to hear it either, but it's the truth. I need, I need to get back in the game. Slowly and surely, I get back into the game. Declaration, thanks for the 10 ED, man. All extracted and stored fish oil is rancid. I hear you on that, man. I just don't know what to say. I don't want to hear it, but I do have to hear it. Don't add mayo to sardine. You had to hear, uh, hear it. Learn the hard way, Beeb. I agree. Tuna fish is sort of maybe predisposed to mayonnaise, but when I saw a minced up sardine, I wanted to puke. And I think if I ate it, I would. The less supplements, the more food. It's, it's, an, it's irrefutable. It's undeniable. It's a painful truth. But it is the truth. And I don't know what else to say about it. I just have to learn to eat more fish. Just gotta eat more things. I love olive oil more than anything in the world. Olive oil is good for Popeye, Aaron? Would she ever do? She ever give him a swinger? On his day off? What'd she ever do for him other than, other than get his ass kicked? <laughs> Bless you. You know what I'm saying? What'd she ever do for him? You know what I'm saying? Olive oil is good for greens. Cheeto, I don't like greens. I don't eat raw vegetables anymore. I'd rather just eat meat and eggs and cheese and, and fish and things like that. I, th I... I'm not so sure people were even meant to eat vegetables. Look, I know that sounds crazy, but... I know that there are necessary vegetables. There are good things for testosterone, etc. Broccoli, yeah. But vegetables every day, kale, nah, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Kale, good for you? I don't believe it. It's not. Tastes like trash? You know what that means? It means it is trash. Give it to your pigs. Give it to the things in the gutter. Yo, goose, what's up? You know what I'm saying? Does that make any sense though? If something is like, but then again, I understand like, and all the children's, cartoons, all of the vegetables were made to look disgusting and nasty. Maybe it's something to get you not to eat them. Look, I understand that too. Where do you find the truth? Spinach is good if you like kidney stones. <laughs> Who wants that? I don't know, man. It's vegetables, fruits. I mean, I understand that it's kind of a joke saying that a lot of those things are bad for you, but a lot of those things are bad for you. There's only a few of them that are worth eating. The rest toss in your compost heap. You know what I'm saying? Toss in your compost heap. Spinach? I don't know. I just don't believe it anymore. Arugula is better. Arugula. Oh, I love the taste of the peppery arugula. I don't want that. Remember we used to eat it every morning? Yeah, arugula. I love arugula in, in omelets. Love it so much. I love it more than anything. Yeah, it's like rocket or raka berserk. Isn't that arugula? There was some spicy rocket. 
in those bags at some of the Lebanese restaurants. Stuff was spicy. It was nice. That's the stuff my dad eats with his uh, meals. Yeah, that stuff spiced. Munch, munches on it as a side dish. Yeah, I like, I like that stuff. Yeah, but nasty. Thanks for reminding me. We need the kefir. We need the sauerkraut. We need the kimchi. Those are the things. Now, those are good. Oh, my God. Those are good. Remember? I wish I had some kefir. When I was pregnant, I bought a jar of kimchi from the Asian market because fermented foods are good. That's nasty. We, I used to Stinks. eat it with my eggs. I used to, I it yeah. every morning. As soon as I'd open the can, Charles would <laughs> leave it. He would leave the table. Like he would tell me to close it or else he would Stinks. Eat. Something that stinks is not good. You know what? If All you make fermented food stinks. No, but you make it you make your own, I bet it stinks a lot less. Or maybe it all just does stink. They, kimchi smells good. It tastes I, good. I need kefir. I need kimchi. I need sauerkraut. We should go to the Korean food God market. help me make that happen more. There's a Korean food market in Kuwait. We should go. Yeah. Try some rice cake. We just need milk to make more kefir. We were I was on a roll having kefir every day. It was nice. It was nice. I like aubergine. Shrimp's nasty. Nasty. Disgusting. I like Disgusting. aubergine cooked though, obviously. Grenadine. Do you know what aubergine is? Wasn't he, didn't he play Odo in DS9? <laughs> what? I, sauerkraut, I like sauerkraut. Eggplant. I don't like eggplant that much. That's, it's nasty, it's aubergine. disgusting. Nightshade. Do you know what Sir Stroming is? No. It's tasty. No. It's that, um, that fish. <laughs> When you open it, you I, I want sauerkraut. Oh, is that like gefilte fish? It's the fish that makes Swedish food. Gefilte? Cute. Yeah, that's nasty. Scorpion eggs. Eggs are good though. Eggs are good. I need sauerkraut. I need I need the kefir back in action. God help I'm me. Scared it's gone moldy. I really, really need to get big into just yeah, I always love the no, Rubens, you Kino. Like the Rubens eggplant. are the best, man. Don't lie, you like a fried. No, but it's it's fried. just so heavy. Corn oil, fried eggplant. I like tasting it though. It's just, what is it? How do you digest that? The falafel yeah. sandwiches with eggplant and cauliflower in them are good. I don't know. What do you want me to do? Nothing. I'm just telling you. I need meat. I need sauerkraut. I need bone broth. I need kefir. And I do get a lot of bone broth. I do get a lot of kefir. Now I need the sauerkraut. Okay? It's nice to have a good one, isn't it? Fried Mars bars. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Nuts are nasty. Nuts are nasty. Nuts are straight up nasty. Nasty. Nuts are nasty. They're nasty. Nuts are disgusting. What can I say? They just are. Nasty nuts, man. They're just disgusting. They're disgusting. Peanut butter, I haven't had peanut butter in years. That's not even a nut. That's not even a nut. Disgusting. Yeah, kefir is good. Majestic. Yeah, I do a lot of kefir. We got the grain, so we make it ourselves. Otherwise, you'd be paying $800, $900 a month buying kefir all the time if you drink as much as I do. Uh, we need we need kefir. We need kefir. We need more milk for that, don't we? Oh, wait. It's already made in there. Yeah, I need to, I need to get the, the stomach going. Internet, I really need to. Really, really need the more of that, the fermented action. Really need it. Orange peel kefir is great. Oh, that sounds good. That sounds good. I like putting maple syrup in kefir. It tastes so nice. It tastes so good.